Okay, the rice is first. This cooks on its own while you're cooking the other one, the other food. What are you going to cook? Uh, we're cooking, uh, what is it? I say <laughs> Mongolian beef. Okay, this is the sticky white rice. And that's cooking right now. Okay, now the second thing, if you don't have all of this prepared first, you have to do the meat. The meat needs to be soaking in the sherry and in the cornstarch for about, I don't, so know, you I don't know, 15 minutes maybe it should look. When you're done, you know, mixing the cornstarch and cooking wine, cherry in there, that's how it should look. Just a so nice it's not really coat picking up the camera, but it's got a. It's got like a nice um, coat, white white coat, coat on it, which is the cornstarch. Uh -oh. Cornstarch and sherry. Look at my girl. Sherry wine. It's Just any wine. kind of cooking wine okay. to marinate it. And then this one, okay. cover it up, plastic wrap foil, whatever you have. I don't have none of that right now. Put it in the refrigerator for like 10 minutes and then that'll, well, I don't have room. Okay. okay, put it in there for like 10 minutes and then that'll give you time to cut your green onion and peppers. Cut them up in there. It'll give you time to smash your garlic. See how nice I smashed that? Uh, from a thing like this, about three of them. Three you know, clothes. Yeah, three of the things. Get it, yeah, hit it close. with a knife and smash it up, chop it up, and it makes it really nice like that. Okay, okay that's fresh. Diced garlic. garlic. Yeah. And what's this? That's uh, this here. Okay, now you gotta get your wok hot for your meat. You just pour some oil in there. It's going to start to smoke and everything. That's fine because it needs to be really hot. Pour some oil, just enough to coat, to coat the bottom of it. And then you just put it all in. It's better if you cook a little bit at a time, but, you know, I'm feeding a lot of people, so I'm cooking a lot. If you cook a little bit, it doesn't take that long to cook, and as soon as you see it getting brown, you take it out. Hey, baby. Hi, baby. Okay, now if you have two of these, more better. But I only have one, so I need to get this meat out because it's done. I need to clean this all and get this ready for the vegetables. Okay, second step. You want this clean put it back on the fire, and then you put your garlic in there, and leave that all off the fire. So, your garlic's in there. See, this is on medium and it's too high right now. And then you get your vegetables that you cut and rinse. Sure you didn't edit this. This rice is better than Kim San's rice. Sticky white rice. Perfect. Okay, now we're ready for our meat. Now we're ready for our meat. When you add your meat in there, um, honey, don't really use pepper, but I like it. So you could put some pepper in there. You don't need salt because you're already putting your soy sauce in there and that's salty enough. Just any kind of soy sauce. Um, 
couple of tablespoons is good. Or, I got some house in the Yeah, that, that comes too. You cut this one off. And this is when it starts looking yummy. Okay, now that's all the cumin you mix. Are you going to come back with a finished plate? Yes. Yeah. I'm going to do that now.